mother gossiping ass nigga. How this nigga whack get all the gay secrets? How the fuck does whack 100 get all the gay secrets? How who is trusting the the straight nigga with the gay vault? How he get the gay vault secrets? He know about Nipsey Hussle sucking dick. He know about this one. Say how does this nigga whack 100 get everybody's secrets about they dick? <laughs> what punk he laying with? What punk whispered his ear all the punk secrets? Cause say, homie, can't no straight nigga call no another straight nigga gay. <laughs> it take a punk, don't you hear? Yeah. Say, say, you punk ass nigga, quit button heads on her like y'all playing football, nigga. Ain't none of you niggas stole no touchdown coming out these cub house hoes. Ain't none of you niggas stole no motherfucking touchdown coming out these club house hoes, nigga. Put your bitches on here. Put your into What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Short. Welcome back to another video. And we got Charleston White back inside the cut again. Now, the last Charleston White video I did did pretty good. The biggest video on my channel. So why not do another one? Now, Charleston White, he's in front of a green screen and he only has one question. How does WAC 100 know all the gay secrets in the industry? Basically, what I'm saying is, you know, WAC 100, he does come out quite often and, you know, alludes to people being in the closet. He's alluded to several famous people being secretly gay. He has done it to Nipsey Hussle. He's done it to Bobby Schmurder. And Charleston White is asking, who is trusting WAC 100 with all the gay secrets? Within doing so, he also alluded that maybe WAC 100 might be gay himself. He basically said it takes a gay person to know another gay person. He used some different language that I'm not going to use here, but basically that's what he said. Short video with this one. Get inside the comments below. Let me know what you think about this. Your boy Shorts. And I'll see you on the next one.